Hey guys, so as you can see, my room has changed once again because I get really bored with where I put my furniture, so I like to change it a lot, but um, I really like the way that it's set up now. My bed is like at an angle because I read somewhere that in your room you're supposed to have your bed like facing the door, like when you come in the door you can see your bed like fully and it makes your room look like better. So I have it kind of set up that way and I really like it, but it kind of makes it awkward to like filming because I don't really have any good place to film. So I'm like sitting on my bed right now, but it's the best lighting, so that's fine. But, and this wall is kind of blank as you can see, but I got some shelves from Ikea and picture frames that I'm going to put there, so hopefully that won't be as blank. And I need to re reposition the E. Um, it's off center and it's kind of bugging me, but... Yeah, so I haven't filmed a video in a while. Sorry, I was at college again. Worst six weeks of my life. I've been trying to, like, I need to have my grade point at a certain point for pharmacy school. And I have to work my butt off to get that grade point. Like, I'm so freaking out right now because one of my tests did not go as well as I wanted it to for first semester for midterms. So that means I'm going to have to work even harder next semester, or like next half of the semester, because I'm home for spring break, if you can tell. But um, yeah, so I'm going to have to, ugh, I don't even want to think about it. I'm going to be starting so much. But sorry for the lack of videos. Once summer comes, like, I'll have a ton. I, I promise. Like, I'm going to try to pre-film like a bunch of videos right now. Um, so this will probably go up later than you think, but I have two hauls today, one from Target, which is all the stuff that I needed to get before I went back to school. Um, I have a bunch of food from Target too, but I'm not going to show that because I guess I could, but it would be really long with all the other stuff I have, and then I have a clothing haul that's because I went shopping for like spring and summer stuff, so yeah, let's get into it. So this is like Target stuff, um, I'm just going to go in random bags and see what I can find. Um, so first, more Neutrogena makeup wipes. I was, I ran out. Like, I was out. So, I had been just using, um, eye makeup remover, and I really missed these, so I got a new pack of those. Um, new razor head things. These are the Venus Embrace five blade ones. Like, I have always used this type of razor. I've never used, like, a disposable one. So I'm kind of, like, um biased towards these even though like this pack is really expensive which is which kind of stinks because it's like the best razors you can buy but yes I had to get more of those and then because I did not go anywhere like sunny or something or nice or warm for spring break um I felt kind of bad because I'm gonna go back and everybody's gonna be really tan and I'm gonna be the pale girl so I got some Jergens Natural Glow um, moisturizer. And this stuff is actually really, really good self-tanner. Um, it actually does, like, help with your skin tone. It, I look a little bit tanner than I was before. I've been using it for a couple days now. Obviously, you can't tell on the camera. I still look really white, but that's okay. But this is for medium to tan skin tones. And I'm obviously not medium or tan, but I just use the dark color just so I can see a little bit more results. But this is just the um, the daily moisturizer version. I know they have like a firming version and stuff like that, but I really like this. So, And they fixed it. Like, it doesn't have the smell anymore. If you've used Jergens before, it used to have this really awful smell when you used it. And now it's like gone. Like, you don't smell like it anymore. It's awesome. And then I got some new face wash because at night I like to use like an acne cleanser but like when I'm in the shower I like to use just like a normal cleanser like that's not um too harsh or anything because I usually don't have makeup on or anything like that like I just need something to like wash my face and get it all fresh and stuff so I found this this is the Neutrogena Naturals Purifying Facial Cleanser and it has no harsh chemical sulfates parabens petrochemicals dyes or I'm not even going to try to say that last one, but um, basically it's just like a natural, nice, just, it just says gently removes impurities and improves complexion for fresh, clear skin. Like, that's perfect. That's all I need. So, I had been using the Cetaphil stuff, but I'm not a big fan of the smell of Cetaphil for some reason, so I smelled this one before I used, uh, <laughs> before I got it, and I like the smell, so I picked this up, and Neutrogena is a good brand too, so yeah. Okay, next bag. Um, I had to get more hair mousse and hairspray. Like, every time I go to Target, I feel like I pick this up. But I just go through it like crazy because how I do my hair like this, I use these two products every day. And I go through them really fast. And I will 
I mean, every time I go to the drugstore, I'm like, I want to try a different curling mousse, and it never works out for me. Like, it never, the, I think it's just meant to be this one. This is the best one for me, I think. So this is just the Tresemme Flawless Curls Extra Hold Mousse um, with the green cap. And my favorite hairspray is the Garnier Fructis Full Control Anti-Humidity Hairspray um, with Bamboo Extract. And I just mainly like this because of the smell. I mean, there could be a better hairspray out there, but I'm kind of picky with, like, the smell of hairsprays, and I really, really like the smell of this one, so that's why I use this one. And then I got a few makeup products because I was running out. Um, first thing I got, more of my foundation. This is the Revlon Nearly Naked um, Foundation in 120 Vanilla, and it's, like, the perfect color for me. I'll probably need a new color for summer, but I really like the formula of this, so I will continue to use this for sure. Um, I got some more concealer. This is the Magic Lumi Concealer slash Corrector um, by L'Oreal, and it's in the color Fair because I'm fair. <laughs> but I just really like this because I have pretty bad under eye circles, and this is just does a really good job of like covering them up. So, and then I got a new eyeliner. This is just the Maybelline Line Stiletto Liquid Eyeliner, and it's like the only one I use. It's my favorite, so I like got a new one of those. And then I needed new tweezers because I had used my tweezers at college to rhinestone something and it, ha it got like glue all over the ra or the tweezer and it was really hard to get my eyebrow hairs out. So I got a new one. This is just a Revlon. It's the designer collection and it has these really pretty flowers on it if you can kind of see. But I don't know. I'm not picky with tweezers or anything so I just picked these up. And then I got a new nail polish, which is not a necessity for going back to college, but I feel like it's a necessity color. But this is Estee's Mint Candy Apple, and it's actually like an identical color to the one I have on, which is sitting back there, if you can kind of see that Revlon bottle. Um, I'm just not a big fan. I love the color of the Revlon one. I think it's in minted, I think is the color. But I'm just not a big fan of like the formulation of it. It doesn't go on my nails very smooth, and maybe I just got a bad bottle. But I just wanted, like, a better one of the same color. And it's just, like, a mint, light blue, green color. <laughs> Perfect spring. Like, I used that bottle, like, all summer last year. So I feel like I'll use this all summer this year, too. Because mint is a really big color right now. So, yes. I got this mint candy apple. <laughs> and then I have one last box. And this is, or not box, bag. And this is, like, actual necessities. I got some tampons like we need tampons <laughs> and then I got some of those little liner things um and I got clear care contact solution this is the best stuff gets your contacts like super clean and it like bubbles up and it's it's really fun but um the solution don't put it in your eyes because it burns really really bad but it um, does a really, really good job of actually cleaning your contacts. So this is the stuff I use. And then the last thing I got was a new body wash because I used uh, my other Olay one, which was this size, which I'm really impressed that I actually used that entire thing up. But I decided I need a new one. And they didn't have the scent that I have right now, which I was a little disappointed in. But I found this one, which I really like. It's Refreshing Nectarine. Um, and it just smells... It's like one of those scents that it just like wakes you up, like you're like, oh, okay. And I think that's perfect because I usually shower in the morning and I'm usually really tired. So I need like refreshing scents that like make me want to actually keep going with my day <laughs> instead of crawling back to bed. But yeah, this says, it just says Juicy Nectarine, so I guess that's just the scent. But yeah, that was everything I got from Target for back to college kind of stuff after spring break. Um, and I have another haul that I'm going to film right now. So if you see me in the same outfit, then you'll understand. But I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.